it feels a bit surreal and special to go into the more or less the last game uh, with them because they were such a such an integral and uh, such an important part uh, for our plans. So at least since since I arrived, both were always quite 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 important for me in the last four years and uh, Alex uh, Alex even before. Um, we will see. So the first will be my players. Uh, I will speak about the starting line. I'm not too much. Uh, not too much in public. I mentioned before, so no time for any gifts or experiments. We want to be there with a strong starting lineup. And um, yeah, of course, uh, obviously Oliver Skip and, and also Tiamo Puki were uh, in this last starting lineup. So I have to make at least uh, at least two changes, uh, perhaps a few more. But the most important topic is we want to go with a, with a strong starting lineup um, there in order to, to win some points. And uh, yeah, then we'll see uh, what the outcome is with the starting lineup. I think they were unbelievably impressive during the season, especially during the second part of the season. So many, many good good results and perhaps a big surprise in the eyes of many, many um, um, before because you would speak about some other teams perhaps uh, to, to, to finish in the top six, but they truly uh, deserve this. They were fantastic anyhow. And I think they will be highly motivated also to, to finish as high as possible in the table and also to, um, yeah, to go into this, playoffs with uh, some momentum so for that I think especially in the home game they will be highly motivated also to take some uh, some uh, more self-confidence another boost anyhow and we have to be at our best uh, tomorrow but uh, regardless what happens tomorrow they have good chances also to uh, to be very successful there and, and like all the other teams uh, more or less like the, the same uh, the same chances and uh, yeah they uh, truly uh, uh, deserve also to be in this position. Everyone was, was, of course, in a good mood and, and was quite a relaxed week. But also, on last day, was also, uh, again, concentrated anyhow because, yeah, we want to finish, if, if anyhow possible, also in style with a good, good performance, a good result at, at Barnsley. But, um, yeah, also, although we trained also quite hard, especially in the last three days, um, everything was a smile on our face. And uh, for that, was definitely a good and relaxed week, yes. It's a bit too early to uh, to judge uh, the situation here. Yeah, of course, from a selfish point of view, uh, as from the club, I would I would say it would also also not the, be the worst if Timo gets some some rest and we don't have to rush anyhow. Also the uh, the re-up anyhow, um, but it's it's also a lifelong dream anyhow the, to play in the Euros with with Finland and he has done so much for the club and of course we back also uh, his uh, his wish. Also to try everything, and it's it's um, we'll see. It's a bit too early to judge, so we will start right now. Also, with a three-year process, and um, yeah, then a few weeks in a few weeks' time, we can speak about okay if it's possible or not. I would be I would label it. I'm I'm carefully optimistic for him because um, he is uh, also quite quick in, in terms of his recovery. Anyhow, when once he is there with with little injuries, so for that I'm I'm carefully optimistic uh, that he will make it through the Euro, to the Euros, but. Um, yeah, it's it's a bit too early to speak about this. Our fingers are crossed for him. Although, like I mentioned, yeah, a bit selfish. He would also um, perhaps even hope for a bit more more rest, and would be would be also deserved because no other striker probably in, in Western Europe has had more games in the last uh, three years than uh, than Timo. But yeah, of course, we support him with his wish, and hopefully everything goes well with Riyab so that he's ready to go then also for the Euros. But it's a bit too early to judge it. There's no replacement uh, for this, and it's it's important that you that you value this moment and and that you also remember these moments uh, anyhow. So uh, we were so disappointed, and in, in, if I'm honest, in, during many many days during the season, because we had some some yeah magic days and magic nights when you think okay, if there would be a full pack kill road, the stadium would have been exploded. Yeah, when I think about Marius, for example, late late free kicks goals or, or late goals when we were capable to to win games or the moment when, once we were promoted, the moment um, yeah, once we win the title. Also, when I think about the, the last home game for, for Alex Tete and for Mario Fancha, they would have so much deserved. Also for, uh, for Xavi Quintilla, for example. And, you know, so after after he scored the score, they, they all would would have deserved anyhow to, to, to finish their last home game in front of a full pack care road and, and to save and to celebrate these moments. But yeah, sadly it was was not possible. And for that we, we, we need then also this little moments when you when you feel how much it means also to to the people that what we have achieved during during the season. And uh, thank God we had at least a few little tastes. But if I'm honest, it should be also a great, great motivation for 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 next season anyhow, because um, uh, we still can remember how great it was to celebrate two years ago the title anyhow and, and to value the title uh, two years uh, two years ago together with our supporters and 
I tell you what, if you're really capable uh, to um, uh, to fight for our right to stay on Premier League next uh, next season, and we we are capable to save this, we will definitely do a promotion program. So uh, whatever the club says, anyhow, uh, if I have to do it all my uh, all alone with my players, I will definitely do this, and I will also invite Mario and, and Alex to do this, anyhow. So um, then we won't uh, won't um, have the spirit for for winning the title, but for for being allowed to stay in the league. So we will find definitely a, a way also to. Um, to to value and and to celebrate together once once it's allowed because what the lads have done together together with our supporters anyhow also during the season although they were not in the stadium was was amazing and uh, for that yeah proud moment sadly not not allowed to to celebrate with them but believe me there will be a time to to value this and to celebrate this also all together.